Here are the top five reasons gaming GPUs are pricey in 2025. Number five, more advanced features. Today's GPUs can do more than just render simple 3D graphics. They also feature specialized cores for things like ray tracing, AI work, and generalized computing. Number four, they cost a lot to make. It costs a lot to make things on the high-end, smaller node processes, and those fabrication services are in high demand, which also drives up the price, meaning everybody pays more. Number three, the older models are no longer produced. AMD and NVIDIA wound down production of the last generation of GPUs. That means you have fewer choices when you go to buy, and so you either wait for the new models or pay more. Number two, not enough of the new product. NVIDIA hasn't shipped a lot of RTX 5090 and 5080s, and with fewer units available, simple supply and demand means when there are fewer valuable items, the price goes up. At number one, the whole AI of it all. The biggest customers for GPUs are AI developers and data centers, and they can pay to get their GPUs prioritized on the manufacturing line. Hopefully the GPU retail chain will even out by this summer, but until then, either we'll have to pay a lot or wait out the price surge. Hey, uh, while you're doing that, maybe kick a couple of bucks our way. Patreon.com slash DTNS. I'll see you there.